Finding the inverse to this function here. Finding the inverse, we change all my x's to y and all my y's to x. With this question in particular, lots of students get stuck. And the reason is you'll see. So now if I'm finding the inverse, as I said, I change y to x and I change my x's to y. Why students get stuck? Because instead of having one y to solve for, you have two y's, and a lot of students don't know where to go from here. But to make this easy, what you need to do, just cross multiply the y minus two into the x. As I said in my earlier videos, when you're cross multiplying, you just cross multiply what you want to, to cross, the equal sign. You don't have to cross multiply everything. So what we want to have to go with the x is the y minus 2. So just cross multiply that. And when you cross multiply, if something on the bottom and it crosses the equal sign, it goes to the top. So therefore, I'm going to have x multiplied into y minus 2, and I'm left with 3y. Now your key to solve this question is to put the x right through, substitute it, or distribute it, sorry. So um, that will give you xy minus 2x equals 3y. So at this stage, you want to bring everything that has a y to one side, and anything that doesn't have a y, bring it to the other side. So I'm going to bring the 3y to this side. So when you bring the 3y to this side, you know it's positive here, so it's going to change to minus 3y. And when you move the negative 2x to this side, it's minus, it becomes plus 2x. So positive 2x. So now, I could take out y out as the greatest common factor. And this way, now we have y, just one y, where, where we could solve for it. And all you need to do is just divide both sides by x minus 3, by x minus 3. And therefore, your final answer is y equals 2x over x minus 3. Usually you write the uh, inverse as f to the negative 1 of x equals 2x over x minus 3. Again, thanks for watching. I hope these videos are helping you. Um, most of this stuff that I'm doing right now is in grade 12 mathematics or pre-calculus. Um, till next time, stay safe. Bye-bye.